This is the visualization for integrating the opposites. Find a comfortable place to sit or lie down, close your eyes, and begin focusing on your breath in and out of your nose. As you exhale, lengthen the exhale to begin calming the nervous system and turn your attention inwards. In this inner space, feel the heart center, anahata, the chakra of love and compassion. And if you wish, place one hand over the heart center, right in the middle of the chest. With every beat, with every pulsation, feel the energy of unconditional love move throughout the body into every cell and every synapse of the brain. Open yourself to this energy of love. Allow it to flow through you like a channel. Every time you breathe, that love grows more radiant, nurturing, beautifully nurturing and loving. Feel the safety and reassurance of this energy. This is the energy of the mother archetype within you. Now I want you to visualize a young child in the arms of her mother. The child is about two to three years old. The mother is so loving, nurturing, compassionate, holding the space of unconditional love for her child. See the radiance and freedom of this child as she laughs, giggling, smiling, joyfully playing and exploring, holding her mother's hand, lovingly gazing at her, finding comfort and safety in her arms the sweetest hugs and kisses. A pure love for her mother. And now, begin to visualize the little girl in the opposite end of the spectrum as upset, frustrated, having a childish tantrum perhaps not getting what she wants, screaming, throwing things, angry, even might say, I hate you, to her mother in the moment of frustration. See the red face and clenched fist and the overwhelming struggle of her resistance and see the mother still loving, holding that space for her child to feel what she needs to feel. All of the upset, but also being a respite when she's ready to return to a peaceful state. When she needs to be held and reassured. Both the mother and the child in this visualization are you, are parts 
of the fullness of your human journey. In looking at your childish tendencies, the tantrums, the resistance, the lashing out, the judgment, the condemnation, the finger pointing, the blaming and the shaming. See yourself in that child for she is within you, or he is within you. How do you treat these parts of yourself? Do you try to hide them, punish yourself for them? conclude your worth from them? Or do you ignore them and project them onto others, pointing out their struggles, their tantrums, their weaknesses, their lack of awareness? Can you breathe into the heart center, inviting that unconditionally loving mother to hold the space for you to feel what you feel, and when you're finished having your tantrum, you can brush yourself off, take a deep breath, and put on your big girl pants to consciously move and act and speak in the world. Now the shadow aspect of this mother archetype is keeping the child dependent and perpetrating childish behavior. The unconditionally loving mother does not allow her child to do whatever the child wishes to do, but guides that child into awareness to feel her feelings, but then learn how to redirect them into conscious action or upgrade them into higher vibrational states or self-expression. How can you recognize the darker parts of yourself that are less attractive than the joy, beauty, and love within you? How can you love them unconditionally, providing a steady, nurturing, truthful space for them to be examined, accepted, not condoned, but loved, so that you can see the roots from where they came. and address the healing there. Practice this mother archetype, loving both parts, integrating all aspects of yourself into oneness. Deepen your breath and slowly come back into the room, opening your eyes.